You're watching the TC MMA podcast. Now, as we work our way up, featherweight fight, fight two. Jose Delgado, seven and one versus Ernie Torres, uh, eight and zero. So this should be an interesting fight. The featherweight needs more fighters, no doubt about it. So one of these guys is likely to get into the UFC unless it's just a boring fight. So let's get into that prediction right now. In the featherweight division at Dana White's Contender Series, you got Jose Delgado taking on Ernie Juarez. Now Delgado 7-1, Juarez 8-0, but Delgado's still the favorite in this one. Slightly. Well, actually 3-1, not slight at all. He's 3 inches taller, 5'11". Both guys 26 years old. Delgado has a 3-inch reach advantage, and he's a switch dance fighter. Now, in his seven wins, uh, he's got three KOs and four submissions. So this guy finishes people. The one time he didn't finish his opponent, that's when he suffered uh, the loss. That was back in 2023. His latest victory is at LFA 188, where he won by KO. And that was back just a month ago. So quick turnaround for him. Keep that in mind. Now, Ernie Juarez and his seven wins. Remember, he's undefeated, no losses. He's got two KOs and two submissions three decisions so he's proved he can win every which way he's been fighting out of uriah faber's uh, a1 combat so not quite as high level as lfa but still some really good competition so how's this one going to play out to me delgado's faced uh, better competition especially in his last fight at lfa which ended in a minute 20 seconds and he's shown that he can fight uh, and fight at a high level so i got no choice but to go with delgado it's not that Juarez can't win, but to me, he's unproven at this point in time. Delgado has a loss, which only makes him better going forward. That's why he's won four in a row. So I look for Delgado to win this fight, but likely uh, by decision, right? Even though Delgado's finished every fight he's won, I think he's going to show that he can go to a decision. And he'll still get the UFC contract, because Dana White knows he's a finisher, um, but has proven himself in every which way. Usually when you get a decision... You're not guaranteed a contract, but I think the winner of this one is. The featherweight division needs some beef, and Delgado will make his way into the UFC. That's my opinion here. Featherweight division, Dana White's contender series. Yeah, so a decision gives Delgado a 50-50 chance of getting into the UFC. A finish is always more helpful. Make no mistake about it. I think Delgado wins, but he needs a finish. He's gonna fight, wait, he's gonna fight, wait, hold your breath till the end of the night. Last fight a call, UFC at its height, yeah. bringing that thunder with all his might, saying, step up, wanna fight, huh? hold up, think twice, ah. gladiator assassin, reckless, no abandon, walk through that cage, he'll leave your ass